Welcome back to Mind Pump TV. I'm your host, Sal Stefano. Today I'm gonna to teach you an exercise that is phenomenal for good posture, and it's good to alleviate back pain or at least prevent back pain. And this is a very basic exercise, there's no weights required. It's called the Prone Cobra. You're gonna love it, check it out. All right, so in order to do this exercise today, I'm gonna to recommend that you use a physio ball like this one right here. I love these things, they're so fun to get on. So let me show you how to get into the position I'm gonna take you through the different points of contact. So you wanna get down on your knees first to get started and put your stomach and chest on the ball. Don't worry, this isn't the entire position. You're gonna start right here and then you're gonna take, and I like to hold the ball, or I, at least I like to teach my clients to hold the ball with their hands to kind of stabilize. Then take one foot, put your foot out, take the other foot, put your foot out, now, all my weight is on the ball. Here's how you get into position. I want you to take your hands, put them out to your sides, and you're gonna roll down and look down. This is the starting position for the prone cobra. The first thing you want you to do is I want you to come up with your back. As you come up and stick your chest out, start to twist the hands as well. So I'm twisting outward like I'm gonna hitchhike and point my thumb out to the back. Before Uber and taxis really popular, that's how we got around. So I'm gonna come up, I'm gonna squeeze my shoulder blades back, twist and rotate my hands, press my chest out, and try and squeeze my shoulder blades back together, and I wanna pause in this position. Now you also wanna make sure that you don't shrug your shoulders. So at the same time, I'm bringing my shoulder blades back and down, as if I'm putting my shoulder blades in my back pocket. You wanna hold the squeeze at the top, then you go right back down into your position, where you roll the hands forward, kind of hug the ball a little bit, look down, and then you repeat. Now the tempo on this exercise is relatively slow. You wanna give yourself about three to four seconds on the way up. So 1,001, 1,002, 1,003. Remember, squeeze the shoulder blades together, down and twist the hands simultaneously at the same time. At the top, you wanna to hold for about two seconds, 1,001, 1,002, and then give yourself about three to four seconds on the way down. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004. And then repeat. On the way up, twist the hands out, squeeze the shoulders back, pull the shoulder blades back, squeeze, and then come right back down, rotate the hands, and hug the ball. All right, so when you're doing this exercise, you'll know you're doing it right when you feel the muscles and tension of the upper mid-back and below really working. Now you'll know you're doing it wrong if you feel lots of pain in your shoulder. And here's some common mistakes. I'm telling you to twist and rotate your hands out. The biggest mistake I see people doing is they rotate in. That's exact opposite of what you wanna do. It'll prevent you from being able to squeeze those shoulder blades back and down. Here's the second mistake I see people make. When they're doing this exercise and they're trying to squeeze their shoulder blades back, they come up in this shrugged shoulder position. Again, that's the exact opposite of what we wanna do. So remember, when you twist the hands and come up, you wanna bring the shoulder blades back and down Imagine, this is what I tell my clients, imagine you're trying to put your shoulder blades in your back pockets. Now, a common question I'll get from a lot of people is, what do I do if I don't have a physio ball? My two answers are, buy a physio ball, and if you don't wanna do that, you can do this exercise on the floor. When you do prone cobras on the floor, they're effective just like if you're doing them on a physio ball. Of course, I think this is a better way to do it, but the movement can be done on a flat floor and be just as effective. All right guys, look, if you like this video, I want you to prove it to me. Like it, share, and subscribe to our channel. Also set on your notifications so that you know when we post new videos, we post them all the time. Finally, if you have back pain and it's preventing you from doing some of these movements, we have a free guide that's gonna show up at the end of this video. Just click on the link and download it for yourself. And finally, last thing, if you have any questions, put it in the comments below. I will visit periodically to come and answer them.